we do. So tell us more about why did you get this epiphany or this inspiration? You're an entrepreneur now. Well, well I'm trying to be. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. I'll call, you, I'll call you next week and let you know after the convention to tell you how, how well it went. Um, well, the um, – you know, my life was, you know, had got, you know, status quo and things were going okay. But I, I wanted, I uh, was looking for something to do that was going to be fun, something where I would meet new people. And the other thing was I didn't have, like, my, I have great friends and stuff and people I know, but they're not really interested in a lot of these same topics I am. They don't, when I ask, when I tell them about, talk about the X-Files, people's eyes glaze over, <laughs> you know, they don't want to talk about UFOs and, you know, they don't read, you know, articles about ghosts or paranormal or they don't read the Fate magazine, you know, so on and so forth. So I, I kind of felt like I was in an island and I wanted Say, well, maybe if if I did a convention, <laughs> um, I could meet people, uh, meet people, we could get together, we could talk, we can learn. And after the convention, uh, we could continue that. And we could meet and talk and about these different topics and explore them and, 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 and go and go, you know, just learn and grow and have fun about the with these topics. So that's why I did it. I and the X Files was doing a resurgence. They, um, you know, they were celebrate their their 25th anniversary was coming up. Uh, they had season 12 um, was coming up, and so there just seemed to be a resurgence. And I realized that there still was a lot of interest in the X Files. People still had, they still had thousands and thousands of fans who just loved and hated the fact that you know. It, it you know it wasn't on every single week like it was before. Um, they you know they get angry at Chris Carter because they don't always like the storyline or how things go. But basically, they love the show, they love the characters, and there was a resurgence. So it just seemed like it made sense that I would do a convention about something that I wanted to have fun with and to learn with and grow and meet new people, and uh, hopefully develop friendships or associations where we can get together and talk about these topics and 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 our eyes won't glaze over <laughs> and that's really that's the only reason I those are the reasons I started thinking about this and started doing one thing after another wow I'm absolutely amazed well let's do a Let's do plan on helping hopefully all this in the future. I love Rhode Island. It's absolutely gorgeous. I used to be a big truck driver too, so I went through there a lot. Mm-hmm. But I'm mm-hmm. I'm very excited that you've got this going on. I really am. So uh kudos to you and uh wow. And then working with authors too. See that helps because you've got authors that can bring their books and set up tables that have to do with the paranormal exactly. or ETs, exactly. and then you've got experiencers, you've got psychics doing yeah. readings, you've got seances. Mm-hmm. Oh, my gosh. So this X-Filers, now, are you doing limited or unlimited? It's X-Filers United, isn't it? United, yes, yes. X-Filers okay. United. Who yeah. thought of the name? Yeah. Uh, me, I did. You are definitely a visionary. This is exciting. So you should. <laughs> we need to write you all up. We do you have your bio with your press kit with your photo and all that stuff? No, we need no, to do that. I I don't like I don't like my photo number one. <laughs> um, well, and I, I don't really have. Like I said, my Facebook? nine to five job is so different from what from this. Uh, I don't really have a bio. I haven't written a book. I, you know, I'm just a, I just, I'm just a fan, really. That's how it was started. A fan led. I'm well, you're a somebody fan now. All this stuff. <laughs> you got to get on LinkedIn. Well, um, what about your Facebook? You're a fan on Facebook, so Facebook, Instagram. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You got Facebook, right? Yeah. Can I be your yep, friend? Yep, it's on Facebook. Yep, it is. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, well, tell us how um, to get in touch with you on Facebook. You got a X Filers uh, United, yeah, just, right? Yeah, just yeah, just, yep. Just type that in, and it should come right up. All right, and then uh, we got to get uh, you out there. Janet and I are big on knowing and organizers are around the world. X Filers United, folks. Let's 
plug it into Facebook. Janet, plug them in. X Fowlers, is it X Fowlers United? Is that what it is? Yep. I've got a web. I've got a web page up for the this uh, show and the other show, and I've uh, tied into all uh, your website. But my site's down right this second. So as soon as we're done with the show, I better call and find out what's going on with my site. But it'll be back up and right. running before tomorrow. Did you put it on TJ Marcy um, T Radio? Our, uh, no, you you you're going to be doing that as yes, that, I'm doing um, that one. side of it. Yeah, okay. you do your TJ Morris radio, and I do the other stuff. Oh, anyway, um, <laughs> we have just a few minutes. <laughs> and um, is there anything you want to say? Before? We we could end the show a couple minutes, Joey. We don't have to take no. I want to find minute, out on their Facebook. Anything? I can't pull it up under okay, Fathers you... United. Jamie, what's up? Okay, talk about the Facebook. X F I L E R S E U N I T E D. Is that all one word? It's not well, coming maybe up. If you, maybe maybe if you just do X files, X hyphen files, and maybe it'll come up. I mean, that's how oh, usually people find it. I didn't. Yeah. Oh, you're right. Gosh, you got to use that. It, yeah. Let me look. Let me see how it comes up, folks, because we got to get this on our record because this is going up on YouTube. Okay, it's yeah. X dash filers United Convention. Yeah. All yeah. right, and it's a real pretty photo. Let me hit like. Let me hit follow. Oh, it automatically. And oh, because I'm a big X file fan. So now I can talk to you. So I'll put, I'm going to go in this little box and put, hi, now who's going to answer this? Is this, is this is TJ Morris ET Radio. So you're going to get one ET Radio. And then will somebody answer me back? You've got 203 people liking this. And so X file can let me go. Oh, we gotta market this. See, people in Facebook are do all this free marketing for you, sweetie. So we're gonna get all yeah, excited. This, yeah, there's several photos, there's several ads, um, so there's uh, a lot of different ads that people responded to, different pictures that they responded to. Um, it's not a great page. Again, I'm not I I'm not a techie. I'm sure it's someone can enough. really make it much better. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, lots of pictures, lots of advertisement, right. pages, groups. Let me yeah. look. Am I in your group? Where's your group? Well, let me share it. I have to go put you in all my groups. I've got UFO Secret Space. Janet, what all I don't even know all our groups, but let me say Valerie uh Valerie is on I'm a I'm gonna say something right now. Valerie but uh, this is important that you do all your social networking. Valerie is on TJ Morris ET Radio right now. Radio. Oh, great. Now, so this is V-A-L-E-R-I-E, right? And then it's McLaughlin. Right. Yep. McLaughlin. And I will put with J-A-I-M-Y, Jamie Mauricio, M-A-U-R-I-C-I-O, right? Is that Italian? Mauricio? That's correct. Uh, actually, I'm Portuguese, but it may may go back to Italian. <laughs> Amy, J A I M Y, right? That's correct. All right, yeah. you two. Now listen, Valerie McLaughlin, right? And it's L A U G H L I N with Jamie J A I M Y. Thanks to Janet Carol Lesson, I'm gonna put this post. I'm saying Valerie which on T J Marcy T Radio now, but I'm gonna put. Uh, oh, I gotta put Janet's name. But see, I gotta always remember. You never leave anybody out when you're doing marketing. Don't but, leave out Janet. No, I can't leave Janet <laughs> out. Let's see. Let's see. It says, oh, no. uh, yeah, yeah, Janet Lesson uh, and Aquarian Radio with uh, Aquarian Radio and uh, Teresa J. Morris. That's me. Is uh, well, mine says now. I've got a. I've got like eighty pages out there, not to mention groups. But I've been doing this, like I said, for a year. But, Janet failed, found out that I was like way back to the beginning. I stayed up at midnight. She couldn't believe me back to 2006 <laughs> <laughs> and stayed up to get my name, Teresa Morris. I was a, I'm was a geeky uh, geeky lady, but see, I was in the military before, so uh, I used oh, to train okay. people yeah, in, in computers. But this is exciting, uh, folks. x Fathers United. <laughs> this is the lady and the man getting this started, marketing promoters. <laughs> They're agents, consultants, organizers, entrepreneurs, and even Jamie is an author. So now we need Valerie to write up her whole experience on where she got the the idea, the visionary, and all that, like Janet did with Stargate to the Cosmos, working with Bob Dean, and then bringing Tommy over to me, and then we started TJ Marcy Radio. I was actually just being a contactee and an author 
and Janet came to me. Uh, I was already on some radio shows, and she had been. But uh, I, don't I know, always she make the everybody best out of me. do things up. I make people do things they don't really want to. <laughs> <laughs> well, <good. laughs> That's, That's gift, a huh? That's skill I, I want to learn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not good at that. <laughs> well, she's definitely yeah. They good want at it. to really. There's. They wouldn't. I wouldn't be in their lives if they didn't really want to do it. And so, you know, everybody <laughs> needs a pusher once in a while. Get out there and do that. But you did it yourself, and, and uh, you know, we're very proud of you that you just took the initiative. This is a big deal putting on a conference. I I did one. Uh, I'm going to in over my head. I did okay. Uh, my inner critic beat me up and said, you could have done this better and that better. Um, I'd like to do another one down the line, but I need a team. I, I, I'm i so glad you have I friends that live in the era. Sick. Remember? Yeah, and her I daughter was I, sick. Her, her daughter. October. She just passed away, folks, March 16th. Oh. So I could do radio oh. shows for Janet and advertising, and I did, and I made her some uh, trailers on uh, YouTube. You know, we got uh, 80 to 180 on Stargate to the Cosmos. Look them up on YouTube, folks, under TJMRC T Radio, TJMRC Agency. And we would have uh, had time. We would have put them all up for you. But, Jamie, you, who, who's got the more time to work with marketing and promotions, Jamie or Valerie right now? Jamie? Well, you're on the you final stretch. Time? You're on the final stretch. <laughs> have you got time? I said – I said we try to split it as best we can between our jobs. I'd say Valerie and I do a little bit of both. Okay. Well, I yeah. emailed you guys. So send me your, your uh, press kit, which includes your bio, your uh, your personal biography, yeah. your headshot, and then I need your event, and uh, we'll get it out. And we got websites we can put out, lots and lots of Facebook. But, you know, you're still up there in Rhode Island, but, you know, we, you got to get all the people involved with X-Files, your fan base, and then – I would definitely call MUFON Rhode Island and ask who the director is or call Jan Harzan in California. He'll love that, MUFON, but we'll give MUFON a plug. Jan Harzan, <laughs> H-A-R-Z-A-N, is executive yeah. director of MUFON. So, uh, but just call and you can look up MUFON Rhode Island, folks, and, you know, get all involved and help Valerie McLaughlin, and we'll get her name up here. And Jamie is one of our authors, and he's a, now an agent, consultant, and organizer with with Valerie, you say Laughlin McLaughlin? Is it? It's McLaughlin. McLaughlin. Right? Yeah, McLaughlin. Okay, and this is exciting because she's got. Let's say her big visionary quest in life is to get X Filers um, united. Let's unite, folks, as X Filers. <laughs> <laughs> and she's got the name and the event, and it just happens to be way up there. I'd be going, but I'm down here in the bottom in Gulf Breeze. Florida, Janet's in Maui, Hawaii, but between me being in the Florida and her being in Hawaii, we got Rhode Island corner now. Now we can make a perfect triangle, so we're going to have to keep <laughs> you two involved with us, because that'll be great, right? <laughs> part, yeah. part of, uh, kindred spirits. Mm-hmm. All right. Mm-hmm. Well, conscious communication is kindred spirits. is called Ascension Age, and that's what I do with 2012 and beyond. And we've got Jamie Mauricio, who did Beyond 2012, folks, so... Uh, You know, let's get involved with that. So we're about growing our tribe. So we are the ACO Paranormal Researchers with Janet Carol Lesson. We're about TV shows, movies, varied mysteries in life, and we've got topics of the unexplained. We're doing X-Files and Paranormal Interest with Jamie Mauricio and Valerie McLaughlin. Tonight with Janet Carol Lesson, Teresa J. Mars. Please find us on YouTube. That's Aquarian Radio and TJ Mars Agency, if you don't mind. Share with us your groups, your social media groups. Find us on Facebook, and please look up, uh, it's called X-Filers United on Facebook, please, and go to x uh, filersunitedcom and that's April 26 through 27. Get to say Dan Hagelin, you better, you know him better as Langley, our lone government. So, Janet Carol Lesson, thank you for bringing these folks, and uh I guess we'll uh, Aloha, talk to you blessings. tomorrow night. Aloha, blessings. Goodbye. Aloha. Right. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Thank Take you. Aloha. Care. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Awesome. Bye-bye. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, <laughs> bye-bye. Yeah. Bye-bye. Good night.